Uh -huh. So it's going to be a challenge for us, definitely. But, you know, matching up, we we faced some good defenses. Obviously, coming off of last week, playing probably one of the best in the Big Ten. Uh, so, you know, we'll we'll be uh, faced with many challenges. But um, you know, I feel we're all great competitors on this team, and we'll we'll always answer the bell regardless of uh, the outcome. We'll keep on you know picking ourselves up and and going after and trying to uh, try to get uh, a big needed. You know, what I try to express to the team is that you know it's a 60-minute game and. And there's many drives in the game. There's going to be some ups and downs. No game's going to go perfect. And, you know, this season's been a great example of that. You know, not, not much has gone well our way. But uh, you have to stay. You have to stay focused. And you have to stay. You know, you have to be very relentless in your pursuit. And, and you, you go out there and you just try to put points on the board every single drive. And uh, you know, it's not going to be perfect, and, and it hasn't been. But you know, you just try to keep uh, you keep your head up, keep your chin up, and, and keep on driving. You know, all that we can do, the, those that are here, is just worry about ourselves, go out there and practice just like we have all year, and uh, keep getting better. And, you know, it may not seem like it to everyone on the outside, but we have been getting better. And uh, we just need to keep a short memory up in this, big, this game, uh, whether you win or lose. So we can't let Ohio State beat us twice, meaning that we can't have that game affect us this week in practice. we got to come out and put it all behind us and work hard and put all of our energy and focus into Michigan State.